Ladies and gentlemen, we are at the Fortnite Summer Block Party. Hey, John, nice to meet you. It's kind of much nicer because I got here late and now there's no lines for you. So maybe that's a, actually you planned it perfectly. Maybe it was 200 I did. No, 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 no. See? Look at that. Boom. <laughs> planned it perfectly, bro. Yeah. We had the Pro Am last year. They've said, you know what, let's go all in this year. It was like a few thousand last year. I've heard numbers of over 10,000 people that are going to be here this weekend. How are you? Good to see you. Are you ready to win? Good. I do hugs. Come here. Uh, hugs. How are you? Jack, nice to meet you. You won the golden ticket? Yeah. You ready to win? Oh, yeah. Good. Good. Hell yeah. And you're here. Perfect. are great. Okay, this is what I got to do. You guys are both a little taller on the outside, so just like widen the stance a little bit so you can come down, be less tall. Oh, us? Yep. I don't think I've ever gotten that in the photo. Yeah, I don't know. Alright, deep breath. So many great creators. Everyone's in town. They were here for E3. Now they're here for the Pro-Am. Today's the creative showdown. Uh, I'm paired with our golden ticket winner, Loser Fruit and Jordan Fisher. So I've got a great squad. Mulder, doing great. Feeling fly. A little less tall. Oh, wow. You're really doing it for me today, man. Hello. You're welcome. You're welcome. Gabe, who's behind the camera right now, he's going to be with me throughout the weekend, make these vlogs as great as possible. You'll be seeing me interact with all your other favorite Fortnite streamers and content creators. So nice to meet you. I was getting picked up when I was getting picked up. See, day two is 14. I'm 11. We're gonna be right next to each other. Which means when I eliminate you and totally box Brett and Yuri out, shoot him off the map and make him cry, I can run over immediately and rub it in your face. Jack. I would never do that to you. Oh, thanks, man. You're so fun. I love you. Forever um, and always. Really? You mean that? Yeah, I, I mean, honestly, yeah. You're one of my best friends in the entire world, but I would never lie to you. It's okay. Two weeks mutual. I'm this might be a surprise, but I want to eat food. Jordani. Yeah, Jordani. My family's here. This place is going to be loud. It's going to be fun. We're about to go check out the stage. Let's go. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yo, this is insane. This place is gonna be packed. What's up, guys? Oh, that's, that's gonna be us right here. Yo, wow. They, they don't mess around. Epic does not mess around with this, bro. They do not mess around at all. Jesus. So players only today. If you guys could go ahead and start lining up outside, that would be great. Right outside the player lounge. Thank you. It's JD! We're gonna cut that part. Um, yeah, we're gonna smash people yep. for charity. And then we're gonna smash. No. We literally know how to win the games. Yeah. We're gonna win it. We're gonna win it. Simple as that. Days, we get set up, so. Oh my god, wait, look at that. Not a big deal. You're a rider, I see you. You've been, jog you been jogging, right. getting exercises. Don't ruin the memes this year, bro. Don't ruin the memes, you're right? Alright, again, Chip. Alright, again, Chip. Hold me fight. back. Hold me back. I'll fight you right now, boy. Oh, God, where are we going? We have to go downstairs. Oh, I took a video of all of my settings. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Jonesies, Bonesies, and everyone in between, welcome to the Fortnite Summer Block Party Day One Pre Show. We're here. We're in the tunnel, about to go in. This is it. The whole squad's here. Yeah! Lama Record Company. We're winning this. Literally, everyone else here are bots, dude. Bots. Wait, Raven actually looks sketchy as hell. Bots. 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 This is no longer friendly, okay? 
I dislike everyone else. It here. was never friendly to begin with. Whoa. Never friendly to begin with. <laughs> okay, okay, I see you. I see you. Pink sweater. Oh! Woo! The Llama Record Company, and that's comprised of Loser Fruit, Courage JD, Jordan Fisher, and the Golden Ticket winner, Lester. So, let's see if they'll grace us with their presence on the floor. Here they come. Hey, if you won't give it to me, I'ma take it. Take it. Jack, be careful, don't hurt your toe. Uh -oh. We know what happened last time you did that there. <laughs> Definitely don't want to stub your toe, but okay. You know, looking like a snack, so it's all Woo! good. Courage always doing that. We have made it on stage. This is insane. The place just now getting set up. Absolutely wild to look at. Mike spaz out in this place. Got that wall paint on my face. Just been running around in this race. Feels like I've been running in place. Now I got hella bling, got hella rings. I'm ready now. Seeing every team. Y'all slept on me. That's hella dreams. Don't take time, take everything. This is fully built out. Brilliantly done. This crowd is absolutely gonna be nuts. Still filling in now. What's up, guys? Wow. Let's get it started. I feel like we're missing two people. Golden Boy and Dr. Lupo! Thank you so much, Zeke, and thank you so much, everyone, here in the Forum in L.A. Ladies and gentlemen, this is it. This is hype. This is the creative showdown. How are you feeling today? Oh boy, oh boy. The team that's going to win right here, right now. <laughs> Llama Record Co. Llama Record Co. So, as we mentioned previously, this event is for charity. So all these players are going to be competing for the respective charity of their choice. A million dollars. One million dollar charity prize pool. Is being given away in, in charity prizing. That is incredible stuff there. So huge shout out to Epic for providing that. It's great for me. Well, all right, enough of the jibber jabber. Ladies and gentlemen in the forum, are you ready for some gameplay? That, uh, okay, GB, I respect we, we, it, we but that's this, not loud we enough. We did this last time, and now, and now we got to do it. Now you got to do it. If you're here at the Forum in Los Angeles, California, make some noise. That's what I'm talking about. I feel like they're cheating the mics. That's what I feel like. I'm a global icon. That's not fair. That's not Because fair. here we go. The first match of the Summer Block Party Sky Station Showdown is now live. And look at this map, and such a brilliant job by Team Evolve putting this one together. There you can see our VIPs. They're in, they have their game faces on, Lupo. I've never seen more serious faces in my entire life. Oh. There you can see Courage, along with our golden ticket winner. The other golden ticket winner is actually going, gonna go in for the fight. I believe that's actually oh, gonna be, I wanna say, yeah, that's Ambush King, Dabiero, who's gonna be in the action. But then Courage JD able to take one down, and he finds himself oh, another. another. Remember, you do have builds, you get siphon. Courage going absolutely massive there. For just a moment, I think he defended the blue control point like it was an all-you-can-eat chicken parmesan buffet, but does go down eventually. I think he picked up nine eliminations. The golden point. Point D has opened up. Players are now going to earn 12 points in this particular circle. If they do manage to get in there, they can really get control of this game. It's actually blowing my mind that we've gone 15 seconds. There we go. The Glama Record Company making their way into the middle. Every one second of VIP is in one of those top three circles. That's three points per second. If they're holding the bottom middle, it's 12, but it's got to be uncontested. Uh -oh. Xavier Woods saw a chance and goes in. Jordan Fisher, the Llama Record Company, they're in second place. Look at him crouching behind the walls, the little tiny builds. He can't build himself, but his teammates can, and that's the plan here is to try and take ownership of the bottom. Uh -oh. Not stay exposed. They got a lot of value out of that, though, Lupo. They're going to go up to second place in currently but they're not on the scoreboard where they need to oh. be. Down low, though, Jordan Fisher, He's Courage, the corner. Loser Fruit. They're going to be tucked they in the corner. This. They're going to win the game. This is it. And oh they my take gosh. it up. Jordan Fisher, Look Courage, JD, Loser Fruit, and oh, no. Lester pick up game one. 
absolutely ridiculous. A come from behind victory. I said that bottom middle point was extremely important. 12 hey, points a second is huge. You can hear courage. You know, it's great being here at the Fortnite Summer Block Party. The, uh, the arena is incredible. Epic did such an incredible job. But the best part of this is my team. Everyone's so willing to work together. Everyone's calling out, you know, Jordan Fisher, loser fruit, Lester, our golden ticket winner. We have communication unlike any other. Honestly, every other team here should be aspiring to be us because not only are we incredible in game, but we're all very gifted and talented uh, dancers and singers too. So um, it's whatever though. Great first game. I'm proud of my team. They carried me. GG. That's the biggest thing. As an honorary member of the, the, of the Earthquake squad, um, I, I really, I just have to rely on clutch factor and looking to my left and seeing Loser Fruit, seeing Jack, seeing our new friend Lester, uh, I just knew, I just knew that it was, uh, it was the right time to push where we needed to push and that's what got us uh, right here. So we're planning on doing that for the next five games and really looking forward to continuing to talk to you. We just won the first game here at the Creative Showdown. Lester was popping off, Loser Fruit and Jordan were popping off. We're celebrating right now, we figured out the good strategy we need. We're getting, we're getting Lester that trip for the Fortnite World Cup. It is going to happen, you just wait. And now it's time to jump right back into the action. Game two, underway. Let's see. Courage JD and his crew, Jordan Fisher, come out on top. The Llama Record Company. Is this going to be a back-to-back -back victory, or we see someone else take that top prize? Llama Record Company was able to come away with five points because they won game one. And at the end of it, we're going to tally all those points to find out who is the Creative Showdown champion. You're gonna have Chandler Riggs pushing on forward. He manages to cut down one to size. Jordan Fisher gonna be in a 1v2, but we'll have the support from Courage. Courage going in for the help, takes out oh. one shot, girl. And it's gonna come down the Courage, but it's Chandler Riggs who gets hype, picks up the Elim, and the Chicken Champions are looking to climb the leaderboard. It might be time for the Lama uh -oh. company to take over. Keep in mind, uh -oh. this inner circle is worth 12 points a second for your VIP when uncontested, and Jordan Fisher is swinging repeatedly. Here we go, holding it down in the middle. No we might bills. see a climb now. 444 points, taking third place. The Llama Record Company overcoming all odds down there in the middle. And I think this is insane. They're starting to make the climb here, Lupo. They're at 600 points. Oh, and Xavier counting, Woods. But Xavier Woods goes in there. But Look, Raphael's not even moving. Someone needs to stop them. 840 points here in a second. They have a, a, they have a lead in first round, four minutes remaining. Somebody. The Llama Record Company, a couple ticks in the uh -oh. circle there. Jordan Fisher, Courage, JD, Loser Fruit, and their gold ticket player may be making a move. A close second place, three minutes remaining. Here we go sitting up top. Again, Raphael unchallenged, 960 points. They're Ladies win. and gentlemen, make some noise. This could be the end of the match. No one is going to stop them. No one's looking for them. They're in the shadows, unseen, and they will have their revenge. The Ravens Revenge, GG! Well done, Golden Boy, <laughs> and away we go. Game three, 15 minutes on the clock, and the team's popping out of their spawn locations. I just want to make a quick note. Flying off, landing down at the bottom, making a move here on the blue control point. There's a, there's a whole team up top. Jordan, this might not be the play. Ah, uh, yeah, that was a rough one. I have to applaud the ambition there, but but they get right back Go. in. They get right back in, and the chicken champions oh. know. He one know. point. It's one, one point, point remaining, and oh. the little whip warriors might be able to come back into this B. But there he goes. He jumps right back in, and that is going to do it. it. GG game three goes to the chicken champions. But here we go. The game is about to start. Game four of the Fortnite Creative Showdown, and we're heading back to Sky Station. Yep. No one knows he's there. There's no reason for Xavier Woods to get out of there. Let your teammates do the work. You have two of the best competitive Fortnite players out right now that are competing in this game, protecting you. No reason. Just hide your pyramid, Xavier. I believe in you, buddy. And then finally, the run here for the Cuddle Crew is going to be stopped. And this is where the Fish Fam can come and take this game away from everyone else. The Fish Fam are holding it down. No one's challenging. This might be it. One, 996. That's a victory royale. Game four goes to the Fish Fam. We're going to go to a quick break. When we come back, we're going to have the epic conclusion of the Fortnite Creative Showdown here at the Summer Block Party. So we have the
the scoreboard and the update where we are right now after game number four. And it is going to be the Lava Record Company still holding on by a hair to first place with 13 points. Big point, the, new, the, the neutral, the golden control point down low has opened up and you're already starting to see these players scramble to get control of it. And it's gonna be the Lama Record Company that gets on in there. They have to get Jordan Fisher in that pyramid though, if they're able to do that. And then suddenly, out of, seemingly out of nowhere, Jordan Fisher flies in like a majestic eagle and lands right on that D control point, now uncontested for the Llama Record Company. And now they're gonna have the lead. They've gone up to 630 points and counting. Llama Record Company could be, a re could be a repeat winner if it keeps going like this, but I spoke too soon. Here in Bulls Nades, encourage JD pushing his way back into the middle. Shots at the funky fighters on the outside. I don't think a tactical shotgun's gonna be very effective at that range and only a few builds in hand. Jordan Fisher attempting to stay on this bottom middle platform is contested Look at the by the Funky Fighters for just a second. Is Jack Dylan Oh, yeah. That is crazy. How are you even supposed to stay alive in that instance? There's so many players focused down low, but the Llama Record Company have now crossed the 900 point threshold. But Fish Fam have done so right as I said that. They're right behind him, and they might be able to take the lead here. No one's stopping them. Oh, just barely, just a second. Llama Record Company and Jordan Fisher holding out that D control point. They're less than 50 points away, but the Fish Fam going uncontested no on C. Stopping them. This might mean a first place for the Fish Fam, and they take the lead. They have the lead, but is, it? is anyone going to try and challenge it? It's like Xavier Woods who jumps in, and this <laughs> could be the saving grace for the Llama Record Company as Xavier Woods tries to cut through this, but they're continuing to earn points. No one is going to be inside of the zone to challenge, oh. but he ends up falling at the last second, and that is absolutely massive there. Fish Fam not gaining any more. There could it happen. Could the Llama Record Company be our first back-to-back -back champion, or will it be the Fish Fam actually being back-to-back -back in this instance? Jordan Fisher oh finds one right behind him. The pressure's on here. He's got to get on that point, Lupo. Here it is, he's take, taking it, he has it. You see the top middle of the D, way He does it! He got it! Oh Last my! Second. I the victor cannot, Royale! I cannot believe it! Last one right behind him. The pressure's on here, he's gotta get up that problem. Here it is, he's taking it, he has it. You see the top middle of the D, way he does it! Last one second! Last second! I cannot believe it! Last second, plays it! The Llama Record Company are going to have 18 points sitting in first place. Fish Fam, 16 points in second. As I mentioned, you gave me a look before. You were like, ah, I don't trust you, GB. Yeah, look at that right there. Fish Fam can easily come back into this one. Here we go. Loser Fruit, Jordan Fisher on it already. And they the they were literally waiting for the final moments there as the clock ticked down to jump in and take that point. Jordan uh, gets cut down on the outside. He'll have to make his way back for just a moment. Had ownership of it. They make their way up to sixth now. Loser Fruit, the Llama Record Company, moving into the middle. Only 14 HP. Going to be a tough situation there. This Stand is it. Riggs, full HP, full shield. Down uh -oh. to the last minute, and finally, Xavier Woods pushes up top and causes a ruckus. But it's Chandler Riggs, Riggs. He's still in it. He's still in it, he's standing strong, and he wins out on the battle, 990, and he's continuing to gain. He's gotta get to that wall, and that's gonna do it. The Chicken Champions are your winners of game six. And look how happy they are there. Gotta give them all the credit in the world. They played that one brilliantly. What a way to close it out. Who is the winner? the Fortnite Creative Showdown. And it's gonna be... I've never, I've never experienced something like this and I definitely wanna thank you guys for making this possible and it's amazing. You guys are making quite the best gift 
guys could ever give anybody. You guys are amazing. Forming. Oh my God. Well, I mean, hi. We're in the middle of the Four Marina. It's it's uh, one of the most legendary venues in all of Los Angeles, really, in all of the the United States. And I'm playing video games with some of my best friends right now, and seeing someone's dream come true. I always want to couldn't give a shout out to the team though. Loser Fruit Fruit clutching up in the last game against the Fish team. Lester always ready on the team pushes Jordan, the best sword player out there. My family's in the crowd, shout out to them, couldn't be happier to have them here. With that being said, we just won a lot of money for our charities, which is the best part of all this. Lester, see you in New York City, baby. And Fortnite fam, give them another round of applause! We just this won. Is, this was I can't believe it. We got first place in the creative showdown. We got the llama. It's gonna have our names engraved right here. We did it. I can't believe it. That was nuts, dude. Our team. We had so much teamwork in it. We were like stopping our pushes. I was going back to like my Call of Duty domination retake days, my hard point retake map days, and we did it. Showed up late. Took home the trophy. I love life. Thank you so much, Gary. Yeah. Is that your Sharpie? No, it's theirs. Let's go! Ready? Alright, guys, I gotta go. Sorry, guys. <laughs> Sorry guys, I have to go.